What's going on guys? Today is Pokemon Day, the official 25th anniversary of Pokemon. Uh, I myself, I'm 35 years old, so I was 10 years old on this day 25 years ago. The perfect age, perfect storm for Pokemon to hit. And I remember seeing the commercials and I thought it looked kind of stupid and my friend told me about it at school and I kind of made fun of it. But I was like, you know, I'll check it out. So the next morning, they used to, I, if I remember correctly, I used to play it in the morning before school. So next morning i watched it and just immediately fell in love um from the cartoon or the anime to the games to the cards i remember shoveling driveways and stuff like that um during snowstorms just to have money to get extra packs and back then they were like four for ten at my local card store then and now sports cards which is right down the corner and uh yeah i mean it's been 25 years uh, i did take a break obviously in that time i haven't been wild about pokemon the entire time you know my my late teens early 20s I was not really into gaming as much and if I was it was like Call of Duty stuff like that you know those kind of games shooting games and um, once I started collecting again probably in my mid 20s when I was doing garage sailing a lot more often and um, really trying to collect all the games that I had when growing up and all the games I never had growing up you know Pokemon was part of that and so today we're going to be doing an unboxing. I do have, uh, let's see, I got the Champion's Path ETB. And I do have four additional packs. So we're going to have 14 packs to open. We're going for the Charizards. We're going for the Rainbows uh, and everything like that. So I know these videos are probably a dime a dozen. Um, it's exciting to me I watching them and I want to, you know, get back into it by making my own videos and maybe getting more involved with YouTube and stuff like that. So here we are, we're gonna get started. Let me crack open this Champions Path ETB. I've had this for a while. Get that open. Beautiful box. I was able to pre-order this from GameStop. It was back ordered. They eventually shipped it to me. I'm sure you've seen the components of an ETB box. I'm not gonna go through it. rules this is actually my first ETB so 10 packs of champions path and then it's gonna come with you know the Charizard V max so put that off to the side and you got some other stuff in here here's the I don't know what this is energy cards I guess some other stuff, the sleeves, of course mine are bent, but yeah, so we've got 10 packs from there, 4 packs from um, one, of the, one of the pin boxes, I think it was a double box, got 4 of those, I'm going to keep them separate because I want to know what I got from where, put these off to the side here, and then we're going to start with the double V box, so we go. Very exciting. Like, and I remember being a kid opening packs and I would always get terrible cards. I'd always have to do trades and stuff to get to get anything good. So we got that and then one nothing. One, two, three, four to the front. And we're starting with an energy. Sharpedo. Got an Arbok. Akabu. Trainer. Scraggy. Pokeball. Nicket. Hatena. A Swablu. We've got a reverse hollow Linoon. That's gonna be a common. And then we got a Lichen Rock Hollow Rare. Again, I, I'm not too familiar with the newer cards. I'm really an OG to this stuff. So getting into the newer cards, I know that there's some cool ones in Champion's Path. So our first one's going to be Rare Hollow Lichen Rock, first pack. Not too bad. I don't know what that if that's worth anything or not. Not that I'm in it for that particularly, but you know. You want to pull the heavy hitters. So, all right, one, two, three, four to the front. Got 
another lightning energy. A bee drill, pretty cool artwork there. Another Arbok. Hop, annoying guy from the game. Very cool Vulpix, like that artwork. Potion Trainer. Full Heal. Roly Coley. Machop. You got a reverse Nicket, which is a common. I guess they put these reverse cards in there to make you feel like you got something, even if you get nothing. Uh, I guess that's like a newer thing. They never used to really have that. But uh, we are going to pull. Okay, a Professor's Research Hollow. All right. I'm assuming that one's just average. Let's let me put the hollows off to the side. My apologies. Sure nothing here is spectacular so far you guys tell me well I'm not live so pack number three from the double box so far not so great not terrible one two three four to the front and we've got leaf energy Sharkpedo, Hyper Potion, Hatterum, Hatrum, another Pokeball, Sizzlepeed, Zigzagoon, Scraggy, Rock Rough, a hollow fighting energy with a ton of print lines in it. I don't know if you could see that. And another Professor's Research. So, the double box was pretty bad so far. Um, not really too much. We got that one hollow, but a couple of trainers. Was never a big fan. I was always the kid. We'd all buy packs together, and then I'd end up getting like the trainer, and people were pulling Charizards and Blastoise and the good stuff. I never got the good stuff. <laughs> I mean, I. I did find some things, but I generally have bad luck with this stuff. That's kind of why I stopped doing it. All right, we got Lightning Energy, Great Ball, Rotom Phone, Malamar, got a Potion, another Vulpix. Yeah, you see people start flying through these. NK, another Pokeball, another Sizzlepeed. We got a Reverse Weedle with the Clay, which is pretty cool. And another Hollow Trainer, Marnie. So, three Hollow Trainers out of four packs. One Hollow, I believe, Lichen Rock. Lichen Rock was the only real Hollow that we got here. So, there's that one. Um, yeah, I'm not familiar with these newer Pokemon, but, you know, what a better way to learn than pulling packs and learning the names. I'm already starting to get doubles and triples. So generally I'd say that double box was trash. Um, yeah. So now we're moving on to the packs from the ETB. This ETB is sitting here for a while. I contemplated trading it for something else, but ultimately didn't want to be bothered. It's just been sitting there. Today's Pokemon day. Why not open it and make a quick little video? So energy. Kabu, Absol, another B drill, Roly Coley, got a Nicket, got an Ekans, Carvana, pretty cool, it's like a Piranha, Swablu, a Reverse Linoon, and another Marnie. So, five packs, I've gotten four Hollow Trainer cards. Starting to think maybe I should have just left these sealed and traded them for something. Another series, maybe? I don't know. But so far, not great. Two, three, four. In the front, we've got Leaf Energy, Terrafield Stadium, Leap Hard, pretty cool. Beady, Beat, Bed. 
Kuna. I actually like that artwork. Very colorful. Pretty cool. Probably gonna need something to drink pretty soon. I gotta get some water. Pokeball. Machop. Hatena. Full heal. We've got reverse Rotom Phone. And okay, Obstagoon. So rare hollow hit. Obstagoon. Evolves from Linoon. Okay. At least it's not a trainer. <laughs> Better at opening these packs. Getting a low battery on my phone where I'm recording the other angle. So hopefully I'm able to finish the video in time. One, two, three, four to the front. Alright, we've got lightning energy. We got this guy, Hop again. Victini. That's a really cool artwork of Machoke. I like that one. Another Carvana. We've got another Ekans. Weedle. Galarian Linoon, which is pretty nice. That goes with my Obstagoon. And the Zigzagoon. A Scraggy. A Reverse Hollow Full Heal. And, ooh, a VMAX. So we got Alcremy. Alcremy VMAX. It's like a, a cake Pokemon. Again, this is totally new to me. But a VMAX hit, not too bad. It's not a Charizard, but surely better than a trainer, so. All right, just got a little Gatorade, ran out of water. So I refilled my pitcher. Means you gotta stay hydrated. Those good electrolytes, all that good stuff. Hydration is important. All right, let's get back into it. Another pack. I don't even know who these people are on the packs. Just know, I want a Charizard, that's it. Probably a low chance of actually getting one, but you know. You'll never get one if you don't try. All right, could this be the pack? We got Fighting Energy. Great Ball, Rotom Phone, Malamar. Another Carvana, we've got Potion, Rock Rough, we've got a Weedle, we've got a Swablu. Reverse Zygarde. Okay, so it's a reverse rare Zygarde. Pretty cool. And then our last one, an actual hollow Zygarde. Okay, what are the odds of that? So I got the reverse and the hollow. Back to back. All right, run through these packs pretty quickly. Normal Energy, Sonia, Sharpedo, Arbok, like the artwork, another Rock Rough, Vulpix, Potion, we've got a Full Heal, we've got a Roly Coley, alright, we've got the Reverse Hollow Weedle, the clay artwork. And then, okay, Altaria, rare hollow hit. So, the new hollows kind of have like lines going up and down. Oh, yeah, so you can see. I was going to say, maybe they have that for the print lines, but there's a print line going across for the whole thing right down the center. So, that doesn't really help. Um, but an Altaria hollow hit. Now, I feel like I've hit a hollow in every one of these packs. I don't know if that's how it works now, but... Um, I've gotten a reverse and a hollow in every pack so far. Just not that great of cards. So, water 
energy. Pokemon Center Lady. Though her was, used to be called Nurse Joy, but it's Pokemon Center Lady now to you guys. Surprised they didn't go gender neutral on that one. Beedrill. Pokeball. We got Nicket. Atena. Lots and lots and lots of the same cards. I guess this is a fairly small set, so Reverse Ekans Hollow and another Zygarde Rare Hollow hit. Guys, we got four packs left. Open for a little magic here. Problem is, as I'm opening this, I'm realizing I don't really care for much of this set, like any of these Pokemon. It's really for me, it's like Gen 1, Gen 2, a little bit of 3 and 4 after that. I mean, I don't know. Alright, another energy. Got Arbok. Got another Hop, most annoying person in a Pokemon game ever. Pierce. We've got Ekans. We've got another Swablu. We've got Inkay. We've got Hatena. We've got Kakuna. Got a reverse hollow zigzagoon. Okay, that goes with my set of other ones. And a Hatterene hollow rare hit. Two big print lines going across. Not very well centered. I don't know. It's falling off. I kind of wish Wizards of the Coast would come back. I mean, I know they had their problems and Pokemon wasn't happy with them. Probably making all the money off the card game. I just feel like something about those cards were better. The quality of the cards, the borders were a little nicer. I'm not sure, but you know, nostalgia, I'm sure. All right, we've got Grass Energy, Hyper Potion, Lipard, Leapard. Suspicious Food Tin, Inkay, Early Coley. As you can see, it's just the same cards over and over. Oh, Purloin, that's a new one. The artwork's pretty cool on that one. We've got a Scraggy. We've got a Reverse Hollow Machop, pretty cool. And then we have our, okay, Ascent to Scorch. There's one print line going across here. Diagonally, but other than that, not too bad. Centering looks a little bit off left to right. But average hit, nothing crazy, nothing I'm really looking for or wanting. Uh, really don't even know what I'm going to do with these cards, <laughs> although they're all these cards. I don't really care for them. I'm really trying to collect, really trying to finish my base jungle fossil rocket gym set. Pretty close, pretty close on base, jungle, and fossil. Got like maybe, got like 10 regular cards to go, and then there's a few hollows I need, probably like 15 or 15 or so. Um, one, two, three, four. But that's my goal for 2021 is to finish that set, original 151. All right, we've got Kabu, we've got Beedi, we've got Absol, we've got Volpix, we've got Trubbish. We've got Rolly Coley. We've got Zigzagoon. We've got Weedle. We've got a Hollow Fire Energy. Pretty cool. And, okay, Hollow Machamp. Rare Hollow Hit. And I'm just assuming there's a Hollow in every pack now. Two, really. All right, so we're down to our last pack. We've got the Cake Pokemon, whatever that thing is. Let's get hydrated before this. Get very thirsty opening Pokemon packs. All right, last pack. This is it. Last pack magic. Does this have a, any of the Charizards in here? No, it doesn't. It's gonna be a freaking trainer or something terrible. Oh man. Yeah, I'm starting to remember. This feels just. This, this is very actually. You know what? This is perfect. The, Perfect 
perfect situation for the 25th anniversary of Pokemon. It reminds me of back in the day, opening packs, getting terrible cards all the time. Okay. Water Energy, Arbok, and please, just last pack magic on this one. Let's get that Charizard. We've got the Machoke. We've got the Machop. I like that artwork. That's cool. We've got the Ekans. We've got another Swablu. We've got an Inkay. We've got a Hatena. All right, we've got a Reverse Hollow Victini. And this is it, guys. Last card. Ooh, another Scorch. Hollow Rare Hit. All right, so really out of this, I only got the one VMAX Al Creamy card. A um, couple of Center Scorch. I'm a champ. Nothing crazy. Um, it's weird. Like, once you open them, you're kind of like, eh, I shouldn't have opened them. But uh, that's it. That was my Champion's Path unboxing for my ETB. And uh, four additional packs from a double pack from a double pin box. Um, hopefully we'll have some more of these videos to come in the future. I do have some other cards stacked up. And uh, and today is Pokemon Day, so I went to GameStop. They were having 20% off, so let me show you. I got a couple of things. I got this little Charmander plush. I've got the Venusaur deck. So I already had the Charizard Vivid Voltage deck. I had the Blastoise deck. So I'm not gonna open them, but just for like display purposes, I like having the three starters and everything so you never find anything at Walgreens but they had the Gardevoir tin and then an XY little blister pack with the, the new Gengar whatever his name is pin I've got to start learning these guys names uh, it's just ridiculous there's too many of them now it's like what's there 800 900 thousand I don't know I only care about the first like few hundred or so but uh, you know how it goes so uh, catch you guys next time, next video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and happy Pokemon Day. Peace.